All right, hey everybody, Jonathan here. Welcome back to a new YouTube video. Monday, week four has arrived. I'm a bit more excited for the week four today. We'll get into that a bit later in the video. We got our breakfast that I just made to low calm. Got a bagel with a banana, chocolate for your life. Somebody in the house threw out my peanut butter. To be fair, there was not much left, maybe like a serving left. But obviously I, I saved it because I was gonna use it. I was gonna buy more yesterday because I was gonna go grocery shopping. So I really, you know, wasn't thinking about it. And I decided to push it back to today to grocery shopping. Went to check out my peanut butter. That shit was gone. So now I gotta eat this dry ass bagel. Luckily there's a banana in there. But still I'm pretty pissed because I don't think it'll add much moisture to it. And plus now I'm down like 100 calories from the peanut butter. I did have a bit more chocolate milk, but this is 580 calories and 100 grams of carbs, I believe. So either way, we should be set. Yeah, for today for the gym. The reason I am excited for the week four is close grip bench is feeling pretty strong. So I'm thinking I can match uh, my PR double or even get like a PR on it. We'll see because uh, blocks before that weren't going so well. So it's good that we're kind of back on track. And then box squats, I mean, it's not a big deal. We'll probably go a bit heavier and get a bit more tension, but I'm not really too worried about that. I might have to run an errand beforehand. I'm not sure. I'm kind of waiting on an answer for that. So I'm only going to drink my chocolate milk right now. Depending on the call I get, I'll save the bagel for when I'm actually on the way to the gym or I'm going to eat it right now. One thing too, of course, we're going to choose our energy choice of today. We're not going with energy drink. We're actually taking pre today for once because week four. Why not? We got the 110 high voltage, high stim pre here. Usually you guys know when I would take pre all the time, I'd have the regular 110. Uh, and then I ended up getting the high voltage during prep. I never really got to use it on the actual PR day because I got injured and stuff, but I have been using it on like the occasional week fours. It hits really well. I do really like it, especially since I don't take pre as much either. It hits that much more. Uh, I got the leech apple flavor. Look, 110 usually makes great tasting pre. I like, especially their base pre. Phenomenal flavors. Best tasting pre I've ever had. This one is not terrible. I've definitely had other pre's that are way worse. This is a high stim. A lot of powder, a lot of stimulants, a lot of different shit in here. These are hard to make taste good. It does not taste nowhere near as good as the base pre's, but it's not terrible. One thing I would say is to just use a fuck ton of water. I usually only do like 10 ounces of water with the regular pre. This one I do like 14 or 16 ounces because it's very, very chalky. Because it has a lot of shit in there. You know, it's a bigger scoop. I would do like 16 ounces of water. But that being said, it's not terrible. Taste-wise, I'd probably give it like 6.5 out of 10. A 7. You know, it's still drinkable. You know, I've had regular pre's with not even this much stimulant. Just like a base form pre taste way worse than this it's still manageable i don't gag it doesn't make me be like when i drink it it's not a mess it's just not as good as the base ones but it's not terrible either i'm just gonna take this a scoop of this is all really that is needed for today and we'll be set
Alright, this clip is going to go in right after the gym, but it's being recorded once I'm home. We had a great session at the gym today. We got a 308 close grip double PR. Very content about that. I think I tried to triple 303 two blocks ago. Failed the third rep. Last block, I hit 297 for three. And it was kind of hard, you know. My uh, goal for this block was honestly just to hit 303 double. And just match my double PR on close grip, even though I know I've been stronger. But my last one felt stupid strong. I said, fuck it, load the green. Did a 308 double, and it felt very good, very strong. Honestly surprised myself. Content with that. Did a low 3 by 5 of squats. 303, nothing too crazy. Then I only had time to do the hack squat, which low-key killed me. Um, didn't really get to do any of my other accessories. I'll probably end up making them up during the week. But just because I was running late, I had to go pick up my girlfriend. And obviously, I did have to do that errand in the morning, which delayed my time by an hour, which would have been perfect amount of time to go do my accessories. A great session. Very happy with that. Felt strong. No pain on the box squats. Feeling strong on close grip bench. We'll see what we get to do next block. Now, you guys will go see what I'm about to eat. We're back home now. Nothing too crazy. You guys saw I had half of a jack speak, so which I did away out. So you know it's in my calories. And then I had eight ounces of ground beef with like 65 grams of rice. I just had a protein shake that ended off the calories for the night. Went to Walmart earlier too. I don't think I recorded, but pretty much restocked on a couple essentials. I bought two packs of uh, the 93.7 grass-fed ground beef. Two packs being two pounds in total. And then also got restocked on the bagels right here brown sugar soft bagels really good carbs and easy carbs pre-workout on the days that i go to the gym and obviously i restocked on my peanut butter because i was out like i said earlier i got organic creamy peanut butter right here ingredient list not too big just organic dry roasted peanuts and sea salt so perfect you know nothing too crazy and I think that's all I bought. Oh, and I also bought string cheese, you know, just a regular ass mozzarella string cheese, 80 calories, 7 grams of protein, just so I could have extra protein on me. If I kill two of those a day, that's 16 grams of protein extra we're getting right there. So when I complain, after the gym too, I did eat a protein bar and a Fair Life protein shake I did not show you guys. It's pretty late, but I have to edit a video real quick. So I'm gonna edit that up. I edited most of it yesterday. So that should only take me like 20 minutes, hopefully. 30 minutes tops and then I'll be able to head on to sleep I'm tired so I'll probably be asleep by 1 a.m. gotta be up at 9 30 in the morning so I'll get a solid eight hours of sleep eight and a half hours of sleep but yeah that was my day nothing too crazy you know restock on the groceries had a bit of food had a great training session great start to the week four couldn't have been happier thank you guys for watching this video if you guys did enjoy don't forget to leave a like if you guys are new subscribed I'm going to see y'all in the next video. Peace.